guys, Constance here again, also known as Haiku Maven. Uh, so today I got a package in the mail. It was an item from my Amazon wish list. Um, on my Amazon wish list, I usually just put a bunch of cosplay items or full cosplays that I'm trying to put together and most use it so I have a sort of um, a mental catalog of the stuff I, I might need in the future. But apparently some of you guys have been using that to send me presents, which thank you so much. You're all way too kind, way too sweet. I can't tell you how much I appreciate all of the support. Um, so the one I got in the mail is from Mick Costumes. They make costumes from pretty much every fandom. Uh, this one is Bulma. So we're gonna open it up. I'm going to see if it fits, and I'm gonna give it a bit of a review. We'll see how we feel about it. Um, I guess let's get started, huh? Piece by piece. Okay. First piece is the dress. It looks a little bit square, but she does have like a belt in the waist. Um, but it looks like it might be a little wide for me. I got the size small. Uh, try that on in a moment. But it, it feels really nice. It feels like it's a really good fabric. Like it fits well, I could probably wear this out of cosplay and be happy. Uh, let's see what other pieces it came with though. I'm just gonna dump out the whole bag on my table. Uh, came with her little neck scarf. Ooh, this is way too shiny. Going around. And this is her glove and her belt pouch. Look, okay, yeah. Here's her glove. Ooh, feels really nice. I don't know if it'll fix. I have weird shaped hands, and these fingers look really small. So the glove might be a little bit small in me, but it's just an accessory. I don't mind if accessories are small. Um. A little pouch. Ooh. This feels like something I could have made in elementary school. It looks like something I could have made in elementary school. The lines aren't clean, but it'll still work. It's just an accessory piece. Another pouch. This one is a little bit. I guess you can't complain too much about the pouches because I can still use them to put items on. So if I don't want to carry around my wallet or phone or anything. I can probably just fit it in one of these. Here's hoping. Um, this doesn't feel like they're gonna fall apart. They just look like they were put together, like, with no care. Like, this isn't even the same size Velcro on this bag. Jesus. Some more accessory pieces. Oh, we got her little, like, sock shoe cuff things, which again, these are way too shiny, so I probably won't even either buy like matte purple socks and actually wear them and scrunch them up because this is a bit too shiny for me. I don't know if you guys can see. It's like, ugh. not too with that either. Ah, oh, the belt. Let's go through the belt. The belt feels kind of nice. I mean, I really feel like it's, um, Feels like it was put together with more care than the other items. Fits around my waist, that's a good sign. Alright, I'll uh, maybe put this costume on real quick. And we'll go from there. Okay, I am back. I have the costume on, most of it. I'm gonna put the belt on in a moment. I just wanna talk about this. I have a lot of a lot of things to say about this costume right now. Um, first, without the belt, this bit just dress is basically a box. It's it's like this dress was made the same way they make um, like toddler dresses for holidays. That's what this dress feels like. There, there are belt loops too, but I feel like the belt loops sit in a weird spot, so I don't think I'm gonna use them. So we just um, we put the belt on. The belt, the belt isn't bad. And it does look and feel a lot better once the belt is on. Let me just like cinch it in the back. I have those belt loop spots this bitch up so it does it does feel really nice on the costume in general as a whole it fits um, really nicely once I have the belt on like I think I could wear this all day at a con be comfortable 
The bags look okay on, but like as separate pieces, they look horrible. Uh, the glove. Um, gloves were not made to fit me. I mean, it fits okay. Like, I'd probably still wear it to the con because it matches the costume so well. But like, my fingers stop down here. It's a whole lot of space. I know I just have um, really long fingers too, so maybe other people won't have that problem. But if you have long fingers like me, uh, you're not going to be that happy with the gloves. Um, so there is that. Um, other big complaints are the other two accessories. Um, her little red bracelet thing she wears in left arm. I'm not using this. This is shit. This is look like looks like. I got some materials from Family Dollar or the Dollar Tree and tried to put some Wonder Woman accessories together. That's what this and hair bow feel like. Uh, the hair bow was just a long strip of red fabric that I tied into a bow and I attached it to a hair clip for now. So these two are the only two I'm going to replace if I do this costume. Um, I, like I said, I don't like how shiny this is, but I think it works. So I can use it for now until I decide to upgrade that. Um, I'm also wearing, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm also wearing the shoe pieces, which aren't that bad once they're on either. They don't look as shiny once contrasting with the rest of the costume. So overall, I am happy with this. The fit works. The accessories look nice together. Um, most of them, uh, except for this and the hair bow, which I guess you don't necessarily need. Uh, so to complete this costume, I'm just going to get a wig. I can put it together. Wear it for my next con. I am excited about that. Um, I do really like this costume. It just even has her number on the back. Um, it is a little bunchy in the back since I pulled it tight to make it look like it fits better. Because like I said, it is a box. But I, overall, I am happy with this. My costumes did a good job for the price point. Um, I'll put a link down to the costume below. This is not a sponsored video. Like I said, someone just bought this for me on my wish list. Thank you again for that. You're wonderful. So if any of you are looking for a Bulma costume, I would recommend getting this. Um, I got it in a size small, um, but if you're like, I kind of wish I would be extra small. So maybe go a size down from where you're at. Although if I was an extra small, the shoulders might not fit right. So I guess the belt is fine. So it's kind of true to size. Because in dresses, I normally am a small. Um, so it's really not bad. If you guys want to go check that out. The costume is great. It fits great. Um, overall, I'd probably give it a 7 out of 10 because the only things I have a problem with are the accessories. Everything fits well. It feels like it'll hold up if I put stuff in it. So I like my wallet, maybe my phone in one of these pockets. If anyone else feels inclined to check out my wish list, I'll put a link for that below as well. But like I said, don't feel pressure to, even if you just want to check it out to see what cosplays I'm trying to work on and do next. Uh, Again, no, no pressure, and thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. That all goes. Whatever. You don't have to. I promise. You don't have to. I'm just gonna collect all the Dragon Balls and then wish that all of you would like, comment, and subscribe and be my friends forever. And that's all I'm gonna do. That's all I'm gonna do. Can't avoid it now.